When I was 22, I was diagnosed with stage four melanoma. None of the approved treatments at the time worked. I thought that my life was over and it hadn't even begun yet. And then a miracle happened. Sharon Belbin was the first patient that I met. It became clear to me that this basic science that I had been working on was saving lives. And at that time, you know, surviving advanced metastatic melanoma was something that was essentially unheard of. And there was this, you know, this aha moment, you know, where the tumors just melt. <laughs> Virtually no one thought that immunotherapy would work until it finally did. Immunotherapy turns on your immune system and allows your body to then fight cancer. The answer to cancer may already be inside every one of us. Thanks to decades of research, scientists are now learning how to unlock the power of our own immune system to treat many different types of cancer. There's a unique window of opportunity here to really understand how these different immunotherapeutic you know, drugs work together and with other agents to benefit as many patients as possible. Saving life starts with the research and getting cures for all cancers means going beyond the science we already understand. The Cancer Research Institute has been the primary organization that's been supporting the notion of treating cancer with immunotherapy and knows better than any other organization how to get in touch with the right people, fund the right kind of research, and move this new therapy to even better heights of successfully treating patients. Funding from the Cancer Research Institute validates our ideas and gives us confidence to pursue them. A revolution in cancer treatment has begun. Immunotherapy is saving lives today and has the power to save many more in the future. The Cancer Research Institute sees a path to lasting cures and is committed to funding the most promising science wherever it's being done. It's not just a scientific puzzle. Immunotherapy, it means hope. I want every person to have the same chance at life that I had. I know that the Cancer Research Institute won't stop until that becomes a reality for every cancer patient.